Nation, we are getting our first look inside the renovated David Geffen Hall at Lincoln Center. The $550 million project took three years with the performance space gutted and redesigned. Entertainment reporter Sandy Kenyon has a look inside. Despite a cost of more than half a billion dollars in this new hall, more means less. Less distance between the audience and the stage and fewer seats. So this project is really about two things an extraordinary artistic experience, but also we want to create a new way of welcoming New York to Lincoln Center. And the president of Lincoln Center is quick to point to an example. On this 55-foot media wall, you will be able to watch the New York Philharmonic playing upstairs for free downstairs in our lobby. The hope is to create an intimacy between musicians and listeners, a connection the old hall often seemed to discourage. In fact, the biggest improvements are not seen but heard. And we always from the start wanted to make sure that this sounded extraordinary. Ever since it was built, bad acoustics plagued this hall, but that's no longer true. The first moment the musicians were on the stage, there was this magical moment when the first notes emerged and you began to hear the extraordinary sounds. An empty concert hall is just wood, steel, and fabric. But what of the music to be played here? Well, the management promises a revamp of the programming to make it more accessible and diverse. So you're going to hear world music, you're going to hear rock concerts. Music to match a more welcoming vibe inside and out. Lincoln Center was built on the ruins of a community that was leveled to make way for these buildings. San Juan Hill was home to thousands of black and Latino families who were displaced when the wrecking ball came. Fitting then that a multimedia presentation called San Juan Hill will help to open David Geffen Hall on Saturday.